Palm Beach County was one of the three issuing that joint statement against the well pushing back on the governor's order. And while County Mayor Dave Kerner tells me he doesn't disagree with the order itself, he says he and other county officials are still urging caution and do plan to renew their mask mandate this week. Palm Beach County Mayor Dave Kerner says he isn't against Governor Ron DeSantis canceling fines related to COVID-19 restrictions, but he thinks it's possible it sends the wrong message to the public, the business community, and particularly restaurants. As the county mayor, my message is, while we're happy that you don't have to pay the government money, uh, please don't stop being cautious. Kerner says Palm Beach County has only issued about $20,000 in COVID-19 related fines in the past year because it is a last resort. But he also points out the county's COVID positivity rate has been under 10% for a while. And even if DeSantis's order might signal that measures are no longer needed, it is not time to relax. Listen, we're still in this fight. You still need to wear the face mask. You still need to social distance, but I can certainly also understand his hesitancy to have the government's hand in somebody's pocket. Kerner says when it comes to spring break, possibly fueling a COVID surge, he was at the beach Monday and noticed people social distancing and wearing masks except when eating. He thinks the public and restaurants will continue to cooperate. And he tells me the county will renew its mask ordinance when it expires at the end of this week. The mask order will be renewed and that will be for 30 days and then we'll reevaluate. But we're at 71% of our seniors in this county have been vaccinated and that's what I'm focused on is getting shots in arms and people can wear the mask while that's going on and they are. And Kerner tells me the county will hold a news conference tomorrow to give you the latest update on where the county stands and to address renewing that mask mandate for another 30 days. Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.